Ladies and gents, welcome to the Gaming Apocalypse. I'm Wraith, and this is Portal 2. Before we hop in, just a quick reminder, you are an awesome person, so keep being awesome to others, okay? Let's jump in and find out what Cave Johnson has for us today. Thank you. I can't believe I'm thanking these people. For staggering your way through Aperture Science's propulsion gel testing, you've made some real contributions to society for a change, and for that, humanity is grateful. If you have any belongings, please pick them up now. We don't want old newspapers and sticks cluttering up the building. For many of you, I realize $60 wow. is an unprecedented windfall, so don't go spending it all on, I don't know, Carolyn, what do these people buy? Tattered hats? Beard dirt? Wow, he's kind of a dick. Thank you for not loitering longer than 20 minutes. Elevator to the surface. All forms must be filled out legibly and completely before eligible to receive payment of $60. Elevator out of service until unknown time. Because of course it is. Station Gamma. Carolyn, 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 why do I know this woman? Did I kill her? Or. Oh my god. Look, you're doing a great job. Can you handle things for yourself for a while? I need to think. I mean, you haven't really done anything to help anyway, so, sure. I got you. Oh, so the next one is... If that sign is correct, it's going to be kind of an off-white color. Actually worked. Is that what that stuff does? So if I put white goop down, then and so the white goop. Let's me put a portal down anywhere I want to. Whee. Okay. Welcome to the Enrichment Center. <coughs> Since making test participation mandatory for all employees, the quality of our test subjects has risen dramatically. Employee retention, however, has not. <coughs> As a result, you may have heard we're going to phase out human testing. There's still a few things left to wrap up, though. The bean counters told me we literally could not afford to buy seven dollars worth of moon rocks, much less 70 million. Bought them anyway. Ground them up, mixed them into a gel. And guess what? Ground up moon rocks are pure poison. I am deathly ill. Still, it turns out they're a great portal conductor. So now, we're going to see if jumping in and out of these new portals can somehow leach the lunar poison out of a man's bloodstream. When life gives you lemons, make lemonade. <coughs> Let's all stay positive and do some science. That said, I would really appreciate it if you could test as fast as possible. Carolyn, please bring me more pain pills. Okay, then. Uh, 
Well, that's not creepy. Please do not test if you are allergic to lunar sediment and or starch. You have filled your monthly test self-election quota, confident enough in your work performance to unvolunteer for the test self-election process. Yeah, that's one way to do it, I guess. Okay over there, GLaDOS? Is that 1.6 volts doing it for you? As far up as we've gone, and yet it still seems like we're so far underground. Okay. So that gets me out of there at least. That's good news. Uh, I'll come up here and do that. exactly what I wanted it to do, but all right. So I assume I have to launch myself up there somehow.
leads me over here. So I do that, and then fall through it. That gets me up here. All right, I've been thinking. When life gives you lemons, don't make lemonade. Make life take the lemons back. Get mad! I don't want your damn lemons. What am I supposed to do with these? Demand to see life's manager. Make life rue the day it thought it could give Cave Johnson lemons. Do you know who I am? I'm the man who's gonna burn your house down with the lemons. I'm gonna get my engineers to invent a combustible lemon that burns your house down. <laughs> Point is, if we can store music on a compact disc, why can't we store a man's intelligence and personality on one? So I have the engineers figuring that out now. Brain mapping, artificial intelligence. We should have been working on it 30 years ago. And I will say this, and I'm going to say it on tape so everybody hears it a hundred times a day. If I die before you people can pour me into a computer, I want Carolyn to run this place. <coughs> now she'll argue. She'll say she can't. She's modest like that, but you make her. <coughs> Yeah, I'll put her in my computer. I don't care. All right, test's over. <coughs> you can head on back to your desk. Goodbye, sir. Odd, but okay. So he wants Carolyn to run the place. I think it's really going to matter either way. Okay. Didn't exactly get me as high as I thought it would. Quite far enough of a fall. Hmm. Do I see anywhere down there that I can jump to that's 
further down. Yes. There we go. There we go. I knew I had to be missing something. Really, I can't even jump over top of this? Oh, no, wait. I don't want to do that. Okay. I see what I need to do. Sort of. Ooh. Stick the landing. the goal. get much of a splash effect outside of that. Okay, 
okay. So now... Might work or it might not. Okay. I got me a ways. I think this is gonna work. Maybe. So I'll line this up just right. Spin along this. Bounce. Boingy. Boingy. Boom. We're over here now. Why do I need to be over here? Because of that and that. to be making progress. I say appear because I actually don't know where I'm supposed to be going. But I assume I'm supposed to just be working my way up. Always up. Still remain calm. Scream. This statement is false. New mission. Refuse this mission. Does a set of all sets contain itself? Maybe paradox is in the event of a rogue AI. Okay. Hopefully this gives me somewhere to shoot a portal up to. If it doesn't, I'm going to be kind of screwed.
Whew. It's definitely not the game to play if you have issues with heights. Okay. So this should take me all the way back up. It's a great plan, but it is a plan. Okay, so it's not the most watertight plan to go confront an omnipotent power mad AI with. Still, it's a better plan than exploding. Marginally. This enrichment shaft may contain unsafe quantities of cosmic ray spallation elements. Well, that's good to know. Okay. Oh, hey. Aperture Labs elevator. A modern era one. That's good news. Uh oh dear. The itch. I'm gonna go ahead and call it here looking at the time of the episode just because it seems like we've got quite a ways to go and I don't want us to run over by too much if I don't have to so I'm gonna go ahead and call it here for today so hopefully you enjoyed it in which case give it a thumbs up if you would please that way you can keep the overlords of YouTube happy and if you want to find out what's gonna happen next which Sounds like we're going to be confronting the Power Mad Wheatley. Well, you need to subscribe, don't you? That way you know when I'm uploading new videos. Until next time, thank you very much for watching. Hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. And remember that life does get rough sometimes, so good luck, have fun, stay awesome. And I will catch you in the next one.